What's up guys, Muffin here, and welcome back to another episode of Stellaris. So, uh, we are, I, I don't remember what we did last time. Uh, we started the psionic tradition tree, I believe. Um, yes, yeah, so we started the psionics, um, and eventually we will, um, well, eventually we will become completely psionic, which is going to be interesting. Um, Let's go ahead and look at this quick. So, where is this at? This is here. What are you doing? Cool. Research that project quick. All right. So we started the Special psionic tree. Complete. Okay, cool. Um, our investigation into the aurora-like cloud at Corinth Prime raised more questions than answers. Distinct tendrils of cloud form whenever we beam communications to our allies' research teams, but only then. Each is tinged with red, appearing jagged at the edges, and they move in an agitated manner. On our own, we are unable to discern any further meaning from these behaviors, but the United Civilized Worlds expects to have more answers once every member's results are collated. Uh, early theories propose uh, suggest these dimension-spanning entities somehow harmonize with our hyperspace communication bands. This accidental lore could be kept in place in order to further exploit the entity for study, or we could switch frequencies in the hopes of dispersing it. Um, let's keep it for a minute. Alright. So, okay, that's great for them. I mean, not really whoever that's for. Um. So, with the allies, alloys we have, we definitely want to continue Result reinforcing. Um, hold on one second. I gotta pause because um, OBS says failed to connect. Alright, cool. Um, I'm gonna pause the recording real quick. I will be right back. I just want to make sure this is working. Okay, so it's definitely working. I'm not sure what exactly was going on there. Um, but anyway, we need to continue reinforcing and upgrading our fleets. Uh, try to keep our naval capacity up. Oh, also, we are somehow negative two volatile moats every month. Um, how much is it going to cost me to do that? Let's see. Hopefully not a whole lot. Uh, ion thrusters, so we can do auto cannon, advanced corvette holes, holes. Ugh, I can't speak. Um... Let's do that, because it's a rare one. Um, I am very tired, so if I speak and it doesn't make Walk sense, well, that's why. Um, that's cool. Uh, what were you doing? I dismissed that without actually looking at it. That's fine. For now, you can head back. So we took down the prisms and everything. We're building our fleets back up again after that uh, not great time we were having there. That was kind of rough. Uh, more leveling up. Uh, let's look at our contacts quick. And as far as power goes, um, the guys that I am not friendly with are equivalent, which is not great. Um, I would really like to be above them, but I mean, I guess it is what it is. Uh, fleet contribution to medium, I, sure, don't really care too much yet, um, until they start doing something stupid. Ooh, uh, this, the dismembered cloud, the results of our findings have been collated, it would seem that every instance of barely sentient aurora, uh, cloud at our federation's capitals was in fact part of a single living entity. The data we have is incomplete, but it is enough to suggest we have encountered a, I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, gaseous in form and adapted to dwelling in hyperspace. Project coordinators theori theorize that various parts of the cloud became snagged in our capital star bases uh, whilst it drifted through our galaxy. It appears to have wanted to reconstitute itself, but without a united effort on our part, some of the clouds have begin begun to lose cohesion and may no longer be able to rejoin. Those parts of the cloud uh, which did reunite soon vanished into hyperspace. What remains continues to provide researchers with interesting telemetry on matters relating to hyperspace. Um, so that ends the cloud event chain. 
Uh, dismembered cloud modifier added for six years. Monthly physics research plus ten percent. Okay, well that's that's not bad. Construction not bad complete. at all. Um, you've finished your construction queue. Oh, another thing. Uh, what can only be described as a dimensional portal has been discovered in a remote location on Grunor Prime. Weather prediction algorithms noticed a strange air current, which was eventually determined to be caused by the slight leakage of atmosphere into the portal. The rate of loss is far too small for it to make any difference to life on Grunor Prime, uh, but the very existence of this portal raises some disturbing questions, such as where does it lead to, and could something come through the portal from the other side? Probe the dimensional portal. Situation log updated. Right. Um, you can get. Let's Research go complete. with. Oh gosh, more anchorages, and um, I don't know. Let's do a naval logistics office. That'll be work. That'll be all right. Our research station output up. Um, ah, look at that planetary shield generator. That's a rare one. Let's go for that. We're doing all rares right now. Let's look at the situation log real quick. Probe the dimensional portal. Uh, what are we doing in physics right now? Physics is the one that we just pulled up. So we can put that on hold for a minute and research the dimensional portal. Um, so that's this one here, right? Yeah. Um, and we are making sure to upgrade this stuff then. Yes. More favors gained. That's all right. That's all right. Um, we have a good deal of influence. Let's look at the claims map real quick. Um, how much are these going to cost? 162, 144, 198. Uh, these are 108. And then 162. We can definitely do a couple 108s. Special project complete. How do we keep ending up negative on volatile modes? We must be using them and not have a mine for them anywhere. That kind of sucks because that means that we have to keep buying them so that we don't go negative. Uh, special project complete, it said. And it just... There it is. Uh, I was waiting for this to pop up. Uh, the dimensional portal on Grunor Prime seems to lead to a realm which is opposed to the sapient mind on a fundamental level. Any and all contact with material from this dimension causes intense suffering in the subject which if continued for more than a few minutes leads to intense suicidal urges completed with or completed yeah coupled with attempts to mutilate their sensory organs even simply studying data recorded in the strange dimension causes intense discomfort in the biological observer and cascading errors in computer systems so we can close the portal or uh, add portal research area with following result uh, dimensional research or portal researcher jobs plus one um Okay, I think we study the portal. It may cause some people to um, die, but it's fine. All right, these are all reinforced. Let's go ahead and do upgrades on all these guys because I feel like that's important. Uh, Galpol is next. Yeah, I support that. What are we at? The enemy of my enemy right now, which we are voting for, which is good. Very good continue as we can to upgrade our fleets and then continue reinforcing them are we still so we still keep ending up negative oh my gosh we need to stop using volatile moats without having volatile moats all right hold on one second why windows can you like stop real quick hold on let me tab out real quick for some reason it decided to bring up my file explorer instead of obs on the other monitor all right orbital debris the orbital space around granora prime is cluttered with debris left behind by the alien civilization that once inhabited the planet before they wiped themselves out their early space programs saw the launch of thousands of primitive satellites and missile launch platforms many of these were destroyed by anti-satellite weapons during the planet's destructive nuclear war adding even more space junk to the mix our colony on the surface has developed to a point where this dense field of debris is interfering with its infrastructure we cannot use satellites and civilian orbital flights are limited to narrow launch windows perhaps something should be done situation log updated all right uh, remove orbital debris scientist uh, in Grunor prime all right so or in Grunor. so let's take you let's do the research project there oh can we stop doing this 
Stop attempting. Now you're doing it to vassalize. Stop. No. I'm not voting yes on a war. But I want you to vote yes on a war later. But I'm not voting yes on your stupid vassalized war. On somebody that's Chips got so many upgraded. allies right now. It's a good way to end up killing all of us. Damn, it is expensive to be upgrading these ships. And we are still going to end up negative on volatile Special project complete. All right, special project complete. Um, with the assistance of our science ship, colonial authorities on Grenora Prime have finished cleaning up the planet's orbital space. It has now been made safe for satellites and civilian travel. As it turns out, a lot of the debris consisted of valuable minerals from the planet's surface that have been used in satellite construction. We were able to salvage a significant amount, netting a tidy profit in the process. So we get a thousand minerals, cool. Good, good. Um, and then you can just head back to wherever. All right, cool. Not too bad. Kind of just hanging out now. Um, you are our friends, so can I do a trade deal with you real quick? Uh, can I buy volatile moats from you? <laughs> they do not like that very much. Oh, they really don't like that. Um, what if I give you, I don't know, like, oh, they really are not, yeah, no, they really don't like that, so I don't think we're going to be able to do that. Uh, that was just kind of like a real quick, I wanted to see if that was going to work. Definitely doesn't seem like it. You guys continually let Ships pirates upgraded. take over your systems, and I don't understand why. Why do you have... You have a military fleet. Oh, it's not a very big one, though. But you have a you have military fleets over here. Just run them the two systems over to take out the pirates. Why would you let the pirates take over your stuff? Con okay, hello. Continued upgrade. Uh, Intel falling. This is on those guys. Um, we have a sabotage asset. So we can... I mean... They're... Uh, let's actually do... Yeah, let's do that. Uh, it doesn't really matter if we put an asset on that because we don't have a good one for that. We'll see how that goes. Right now... Oh my god. All of a sudden, we're losing rare crystals too. That's cool. Because apparently we started using lots of those. Um, how many do we have? 54 and we're using 3. Uh, that's fine. You guys keep claiming our stuff. But it's not like you're actually going to get anything. Um, we should probably do something about this. Okay, what's it going to cost for me to do three? Probably a lot. Uh, one is twelve, so yeah. A decent bit, and that's only going to get us to break even. Uh, the enemy of my enemy has Ships passed. Upgraded. Cool, ships upgraded. Let's do this again. Spaceborn life form encountered. Okay, new Federation president. Uh, these guys joined the Galactic Empire. Somebody joined the Galactic Empire. I didn't see who it was. But it was somebody that just kind of appeared. Uh, can you show me which one that is? That's these guys. Where are you at? You are down here. You are a break-off empire. That's fine. I don't really care about you, then. Um, Corvette hull points. Forget hull points. Up 10%. Uh, crystal forge plating. Auto cannon are always going to be options there. Um, gas extraction wells. We should probably get that rolling. Uh, that would probably be a very good idea right now. Continue moving on. That's fine. More migration treaties, which I don't really care about. Why do you not have an admiral? I... Oh, all right, hold on one second. I want an admiral. Okay, let's bring this back over now. Uh, the confidence wavers. Uh, we're gonna see what happens. Unwavering in sight. Yes, we got the good one. Operation difficulty negative one. Or minus one, I guess. Good, that's Space a good one. Life form encountered. All right, planetary shield generator and orbital shield generator up uh plasma thrower phase disruptor plasma throws the shortest one so we'll get that rolling good good 
we are breaking even on our crystals minus on our volatile notes, which is okay for right now. I don't think um, we're really in a position to worry about that too much. I mean, I don't have Ships energy upgraded. credits to be buying that stuff constantly. Oh, cool. We got more upgrades. Uh, and it's costing, so that's what. It's costing our crystals um, and a lot of alloys. Why would you declare that? I, I don't understand sometimes why some of the AI empires do that. They're like, oh, instead of waiting however many days it is, this needs to be an emergency measure. No, it doesn't. All right, traditions. So we want to take the other uh, psionics one that we have to take, mind readers. Based until level plus 10, uh, sight beyond sight empire edict. Um, so the next one after that will be great awakening. Uh, all latent psionic will unlock their full potential. Psionic assimilation uh, can get theirs. Um, breach the Shroud, new special project. And then um, we're going to want... Uh, what is this? Shrouded communications. Oh, you have to have this one in order to get those. Yeah, that makes sense. And then we'll be able to do some fun psionic stuff. Exciting. Um, so that one... Unlocked an edict. Unlocked it. Yeah, unlocked an edict, didn't it? Uh, sight beyond sight. Cost 1.87 of whatever that is. Of that, which we don't have. Yeah, we don't have any of it. Um, gives us sensor range, jump time, and all sorts of good stuff. Uh, how much does one of these cost? Oh, I can't buy it. Huh. Okay, so it's one that you have to have in your borders, I guess. And we don't. Okay. Well, that's kind of annoying. So we can't really do anything with that. I was going to say, if we can do that, we might as well. Uh, you need upgraded. It's going to cost us lots of alloys to do these upgrades, but they need done. We need, you know, our military to continue to be high-powered. Because eventually we're going to go to war. Uh, are you friends with anybody right now? You have a defensive pact with the guys on the other side of me. Surprise. Um, and you're, yeah. That's great. So, kind of hope they break off their defensive pact at some point. Because otherwise, that's going to be bad. Because they'll be able to pinch us from both sides. And I really don't want that. I'd really prefer that not to be a thing. Um, doo -doo -doo. so next one to be upgraded. Oh, the rest. Why do you, two ships need to be upgraded for sixty-six? Ships. Upgraded. Well, here I thought they were gonna be big ones, but I guess with these, it's not really that big of a deal because they didn't need to be upgraded ships already. Upgraded. All right. Ships cool. Upgraded. So our ships are all ships upgraded. upgraded now. Uh, you finish your queue. Let's do another shipyard, and do you have a trade hub? You don't have a trade hub. Let's do a trade hub, off-world trading. Uh, plasma thrower, which means more upgrades. Um, gamma laser, artisan output. I mean, black hole observatory is going to be a good one to have. How much is it going to cost now? 39. That's not bad. Ships upgraded. Oh, who died? A scientist. Well, there's one for psionics. We'll hire this guy for now. And then we can go through and it's not going to cost a whole lot. Upgrade all these again. Okay. So we've continued upgrading. We also should continue upping our naval capacity. Um, let's sell that. Oh, cool. So we can afford to buy some rare crystals so that we're a little bit higher since we are kind of breaking even on those. We should probably buy some vault downloads, but it's fine. Um, all right, cool. An update to the espionage. Ooh. Admiral revealed as a psychic. While it is rare for psionic powers to manifest after adolescence, it is not unheard of. Admiral the that <laughs> has recently been displaying abilities that were suspected to be psionic in nature. After ongoing... Un ongoing. Wow, I am really... Ooh. 
After undergoing a thorough ESP test, uh, he has been identified as a class 4 psionic talent. Cool. Ships upgraded. All these ships being upgraded. That's good. That's good. Ships upgraded. Cool. All right. Um, so do I have research complete? All right. Cool. Uh, gas extraction well, so we can start getting that. Um, do we want to just do? Well, let's do railgun. We might as well, because the ones that are always going to be there are always going to be there. Um, let's go build a mining station there. Get some exotic gases. Because, you know, Station why not? Under attack. Oh, good. Pirates. Where are they at? They're literally one system down from where I have one of my fleets. Goodbye, pirates. You're about to die. Did they just, like, lose? I, it definitely looks like they just lost. Did the whales kill them? Or did the station kill them? Not really sure. I don't care. Alright, get rid of that. A scientist revealed as a psychic. Blood is rare, blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool. I need to stop putting my hand on the... Uh, what's it called? Not the mouse. The mouse pad. Not the mouse pad. Whatever you want to call it. Space -born life -form the encountered. laptop thing. Uh, oh. The Senate session on Galpole was prematurely concluded by the Galactic Custodian. Did they really... Wait, hold on. Oh, so they, it passed, and they, why? What was the point of that? It was already going to pass, I'm pretty sure. I wasn't really paying attention, though, so maybe it wasn't. Uh, let's look at the fleet manager. We should probably up a new fleet. Uh, we'll set their home base later, do Corvette, destroy our cruiser, and might as well start reinforcing. Um, because, like I said before, we want our military power moving up, because we are equivalent to these guys, and I don't want to be equivalent to those guys forever. I want to overpower them, because eventually, I want to go to war with them. Um, no, we're not ending that. I'm going to continue with the espionage process. Alright, so, okay, cool. So we have one here one here, one here, and one here. Maybe we do... There's not a planet here, is there, that we can colonize? What is this? Okay. Alright. More stuff for that. Um, is there anywhere that we have, like, a planet that we don't have anybody chilling up there? But I kind of want somebody to be over here, since it's kind of a pain. Maybe we'll have the new one home base set at here. And we can give you a good admiral. Ooh, you're psychic. I like that. We want the ones that are psychic. And then we can continue to build up so that we don't fall below 50% of our naval capacity. Should probably look at more planets to colonize. Do we have any other... Do we have any other planets that can be colonized? I mean... I don't know. Um, do, 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 you can go chill wherever. Because now that you did that mining station, you're all good. We explored the wormhole, right? Yep. Cool, cool. Not doing too bad. Uh, what are the numbers? Complete. 58 and 2. Uh, you finally finished your construction queue. Cool. We should probably do defense platforms for some of these, but like, eh, oh well. All right, um, uh, let's look at this. There's no reason to drop their performance. Um, progress has been put on hold. Um, I mean, we can just, as long as it continues on. Continue it and keep her moving. All right, what's up next for this? Comfort Research the Fallen. Complete. Um, unemployed. Uh, dip diplomatic weight from tech is down. I don't really think I care too much yet. Um, subspace sensors, black hole observatories. Um, research station output. I mean, 
Yeah, that's going to be the shortest one. Do we have a black hole anywhere? Yeah, we do. We have one here. So if you upgrade... Well, then let's upgrade that. And we can... We sh that's a black hole, right? Yeah, so we can do a black hole observatory there. Any black hole system that we have, which I think we only have one. Research complete. Do that for. Because I think it's like a research bonus then. Um, Alright, railgun. Which means we can do some upgrades. Um, destroy all hull points, habitat. Let's do with the, the armor. You have a defense platform that can be upgraded, so let's get that going. Ships upgraded. Alright, and then looking at you guys, it's going to cost 30. So let's go ahead and upgrade you. Because, well, if we have the resources to do it, we might as well. Uh, what's the next one that's going to end? Uh, thought enforcement. Ah, so that's the new edict. Um, okay. Happiness down, but encryption... Governing Ships ethics, attraction, and telepath jobs. Alright. Is this soon going to be, like, reinforced? You're already at full strength. Where are the rest of your things at? Alright, Comfort the Fallen is being voted on. I don't really care too much. I'm excited for the psionic stuff. Ah, okay. So, building. Black Hole Observatory. And we might as well do a shipyard and an anchorage there as well. And then we can upgrade Ships that. Ships upgraded. Ships upgraded, that's fine. Um, and then we can just continue Research upgrading you. Alright, Thought Enforcement Edict unlocked. Uh, leader Lifespan plus 10 years. Uh, let's do that. I'm trying to get some of the shorter ones out of the way ASAP. Um... How much more? 11 months. 10 months. And then we'll have Great Awakening. Uh, Leighton Sionics unlocking their full potential. Yes, that is exactly what I like to hear. The more Sionic stuff we can get into, the better. I've never played a game with Sionics before, so I'm interested to see how this goes. Alright, you are reinforced completely. Let's go to Fleet Manager. And we can just up this a good bit. And then go ahead and reinforce it. Cool, cool. Continue getting that taken care of. Because we want more military. That's great. Uh, yeah, let's keep doing that. As long as, as long as that's being offered, I think I will never stop taking that. And I feel like I talk about that in every episode. Uh, that's not a surprise. It was a breakaway empire, right? They got absolutely destroyed. That's usually how it goes. They break away, get into a war, and then they die instantly. Whatever. That's why I don't bother to, like, look at them too much. Um, let's buy some volatile moats. That's, like, a one-time thing, because we're getting close to the cap there. Um, commence the operation. Let's go. All right, research secured. Our infiltration attempt uh, has proceeded flawlessly. The trust we manufactured was just sufficient to grant us a window of opportunity. All right, so we got place steel materials uh, and 30% of it. Cool. Um, and then our tradition, so let's get the Great Awakening. All right, the Great Awakening. The Savelli species has experienced what can only be described as a Great Awakening. For a time now, we have been aware of the great psionic potential inherent in our species, but such powers have only manifested themselves in a small minority. Until now. Almost overnight, Savelli everywhere have unlocked their full psionic cap- I almost say capability- capacity. Uh, it is as if some sort of communal pool of Savelli psychic energy finally reached a critical tipping point, collectively awakening the latent abilities of our brains. Telepathy has already replaced most verbal communication between Savelli, and this is only one small example of the innumerable, innumerable changes our society is faced with. We are now uh, tied together in a way few of us could have ever imagined. Alright, so that gets us psionic assimilation. Can I... Is that under... Is that something that I can actually, like, do? Or is that automatic? Um, 
Robotic workers. I'm just looking real quick. Um, I don't see anything right away. Or is it in edicts? I don't see one in edicts either. Oh, there's the thought enforcement one. But I don't see anything for... Alright. We'll look look at that later, maybe. Um, but Research we are complete. becoming psionic. Play steel armor. So we can do auto cannon, crystal forge plating, which are still there. Minerals from miners up, sure. Quick ones. Get, get the quick ones down. Where is my phone? I keep forgetting where I put it, because I put it on the charger. Alright. Uh, you all need upgraded. It's actually going to be relatively expensive. Um, more expensive than I thought it would be. Alright. We'll do that. Of course. And then we can buy some alloys. So we can reinforce you. And then continue to upgrade the ones that need upgraded. We're, we're starting to look pretty good. We are getting there as far as our naval capacity goes. Uh, relic activation, that's fine. I'm not really doing anything that I need to worry about that for. Research complete. Um, research station output up. So tachyon sensors, advanced research complexes, plasma accelerator, let's do that. All right, we're doing good. I'm liking the direction we're going. Uh, defensive pact. Whatever. Research complete. Research complete. Uh, leader lifespan plus 10 years. Let's do the tile blockers because that's going to be less than a year. And it's one that we're probably going to want. Uh, are you, like, new? Yeah, you are. You're a breakaway. And you open your borders to us. That's fine because you're probably going to be gone in, like, a year anyway. That's usually how it goes. All right more so it goes up to 50 so let's do Ships that upgrade. reinforce and then get you upgrading the more upgrades we ships do the better upgraded. ships upgraded fantastic um we still don't have anything higher than what uh cruisers i don't remember what's after cruisers I don't remember. We'll find out eventually when it pops up in our tech. But I would like to have that. Oh, gosh. Okay. I would like eventually, too, to have... Uh, well, whenever the, like, Titans and stuff become a thing. I don't remember. Or I, I don't know how long it'll take to get to that in this game. Uh, in my other game, it took me a good bit, but... That game stretched on for a... Well, is still stretching on for a long time because that's what I set it up for. Research um, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, tile blocker is done. Starbase capacity up. Uh, crime and amenities. I think we'll go for that. That'll be helpful for some of our planets. Uh, you can go ahead and be upgraded. That is fine. Once these guys are fully reinforced and upgraded, I'll send them over here. Um, are you done? You are upgrading right now. I was going to say, I'd like that to be done here soon. Good, good. Ships upgraded. More upgrades done. You are still being reinforced. After that, we can do the destroyers and one cruiser. Cool. Research complete. All right. Minerals from miners and starbase constructions. Ooh, starbase building and module cost. Let's do that. That's a rare one. I keep getting distracted from doing the ones that are always there by like rare techs and stuff. Let's go ahead and get you upgrading too, so we can have that finished. I am liking this. Uh, where are you at? You're here. Construction complete. Uh, okay, so you finished your upgrade, which means we can do, we can do a trade hub here. I don't see why not. And then another anchorage, uh, crew quarters we're going to need there. That Ships will be very upgraded. helpful. 
Um, and then we can set you... Oh, I already... No, I didn't. Oh, I'm lacking the uh, alloys to do it. I was going to say, I'll set you to just upgrade right away. That's going to cost a good bit. So we'll have to wait a little bit for that. Research complete. All right. Plasma accelerator, which means more upgrades. Um, shield capacitor is the next short one. Let's do that. Unfortunately, lots and lots of upgrades. Um, how much is that going to cost? 25. That's not bad at all. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Ships upgraded. Ships upgraded. That's all right. What I've been working at. Uh, past comfort the fallen. That is all right. Don't Ships really have upgraded. strong opinions about that. As soon as I can, I'm going to go ahead and reinforce these. Oh, they don't. They must not have good allies. Uh, who are their allies? Alloys, yeah, allies. Uh, Cerulean Commonwealth. So it's these guys and these guys. I don't really want to be involved. Who's voting? Somebody. There's one more vote. Although it's got to be unanimous. If they vote yes, I mean... Oh, they're going to vote with me, aren't they? I'm not going to vote yes to that. I don't really want to go to war right now. I'm trying to, like... Up stuff. Mm -hmm. Not go to war immediately. Because I don't really want to do that right now. Alright, how cheap is it to upgrade these? 198. Dang. Alright, crime and amenities. Good, good. Uh, tile blockers, command center building. Let's do tile blockers. Get those out of the way, because I know eventually if we don't, we'll run into a problem with them. Uh, scavenger bot there. I thought the gateway was going to be there. I was going to go take that. Um, from... Let me guess. Let me guess. You are a, another breakaway state. Yep. Always happens. Always the breakaway states. That's fine. It is what it is. Um, you're being reinforced right now. Let's go ahead and just do that. Get some more upgrades going before the next upgrade comes in. Because, you know, we're going to have one here soon. Um, so we have a little over a year complete. before we have our next one. Uh, breach the shroud and shrouded Research communications. Um, you finished your construction queue. Go ahead and upgrade a while. Um, why emergency resolution for cooperative research? Seriously? What was the point of that? Why? Okay, whatever. Um, shield capacitor. Look, more upgrades. Um, let's do the tachyon sensors. I'm not really sure what that's going to do. We might as well go for it, right? Uh, you are finished re being reinforced. So we want to do that. And then we might as well just go for it all at once. So then they will be officially 100% reinforced. And then we can upgrade them and send them on their way to where they're going to be sitting at for right now. All right, what's up? They've joined the Galactic community, and then they're probably going to be crushed Incoming here soon. Transmission. Sure, we can do a migration treaty, but you're in a war and you're going to lose. I have never Ships seen upgraded. somebody try to break away and actually, like, such a small state try to break away and actually win. Not once. All right. How much does it cost to upgrade? It's 198. All right, not great. Uh, it's gonna cost you over a thousand to reinforce you, so we might as well just wait. We're gonna do it all in one shot. Actually, well, let's just do that. Research complete. And then we can do it. Ooh, I just like did not mean to do that. All right, reinforce fleet there. Uh, Starbase building and module cost. Quantum missiles, engineering research. Quantum missiles sounds good, but let's do auto cannons. Get that done. 
I've been waiting on that for a long time, so. Rising unemployment, let's do increased benefits. Go ahead and get these upgrades going. Uh, what do we get? Tile blockers. Uh, claim influence, war exhaustion game. Fleet command limit for Gigamall and all of that. Let's do that one. And let's get you tacked for update a while. For update, yeah, upgrade a while. Tradition. Let's go for Shrouded Communications first. And we are just about to be done with the Psionics tree. Cool, cool. More reinforcements happening. Then uh, we'll do a, a relatively inexpensive uh, upgrade and then get them rolling over there. Exciting, exciting. And then we still have another, what, almost 100 naval capacity? So we can start using the any technology we get for uh, naval capacity up now. All right. You are almost Ships reinforced. Upgrade. Just waiting on the last cruiser. These guys are done upgrading. You are Ships completely upgrade. reinforced. Let's upgrade you quick. And then we'll move you over. Ships upgraded. Pretty good. Ooh, I didn't mean to do that. Construction complete. You finished your queue. Which means we can add. Um. Let's do a shipyard and an anchorage, and then we can do an off-world trading company there to go with their trade hub. All right, good, good. These guys are not upgrading yet because you're both trying to upgrade. Why? Why do they always pick a station that's not theirs to go to? Like, at least you're at yours. You're at your own. You're at your own. Why did you travel there? When you have to be... Hold on, both of you are supposed to be there, what? Okay, so they're not. These guys should probably not be over there. Let's put them up here, I guess. I didn't realize I did that. Um, well, yeah, we'll assign them to different places. Uh, research storage, migration treaty proposal, whatever, whatever. Um, let's use some of our influence for some claims. We'll do some of the expensive ones here, just so we're not maxed out anymore. Uh, you, I want you to return to your home station. Okay, so you are at your home, you're at your home, you are at your home. You are at yours, you're on your way to yours, and then as soon as you're done being upgraded, you'll be on your way. Pirates, where are they at this time? Cool. Uh, same place as last time. They're not going to survive very long. Yeah. <laughs> they don't usually survive for more than two seconds. So you can return, that's fine. Research complete. Alright. Auto cannons. We can do crystal forge plating, Elgate Insight. I think we do the Elgate Insight. Because we are only at what? Uh, we are at 3 out of 7. That'll be 4 out of 7. So, uh, honestly, we may not ever finish it. Whatever. I don't really care that you're closing your borders to me. How much is this going to cost? 33. Cool. Who is insulting me? From you guys? Whatever. Probably because I just... No, that's from you. I claimed a bunch of your systems. Oh, well. Ships upgraded. Good. Upgrade them. Do these quick upgrades. Ships upgraded. Uh, did that apply? Yeah, it did. To your one defense platform that I have. Research storage full. Cool. Let's buy some alloys then. Keep ourselves looking all right. Ships upgraded. More ships finishing their upgrades. Which is very good. Can you soon be done, dude? You are so close. Ships upgraded. All right, you need to upgrade it again, but it's not going to take very long. Ships upgraded. Okay, so then I don't know why I clicked out of you. You can go home. All right, doing some good reinforcement here. 
These guys are on their way. They are quite a bit, uh, or quite a way away, but they'll get there eventually. All right. Uh, yeah. Breakaway Research state, I'm complete. assuming. Breakaway states never really survive. That's fine. Tachyon sensors. That's going to be an upgrade. Um, so we can do hyperdrive three network movement. Uh, plasma cannons, phase disruptors. Let's do plasma cannon. That sounds like fun. How much is this gonna cost? 130. That's not terrible. Research complete. So we can do that. Um, there we go. Got that done. Starbase capacity up. Naval capacity up. Let's do naval capacity since we're starting to get close to that. Construction complete. All right. You're upgrading. You have finished your construction queue, which is perfect. Um, Ships upgraded. You are at your home, correct? Yes. All right. So you can upgrade. Um, you are moving. You are at your home. Let's go ahead and upgrade you as well. So Ships we have the alloys upgraded. to do it right now. We might as well. The more good stuff we Ships can get, the better. Upgraded more ships upgraded you are almost there you are two systems away that's awesome you're being ships taken over upgraded. by pirates now which is fantastic to watch I don't understand you have fleets there just run them the couple systems over to take the pirates out I don't understand why the AI never does that they just let the pirates take over half their systems whatever not my decision you are at your home. Cool. So you can prep for upgrades. How long is that going to take you? Not very long. Increased benefits, whatever. We are maxed out on that. That is fine. Let's go ahead and sell some and then buy some volatile moats, I guess. Because we're not, vol yeah, volatile moats. Might as well. Almost all of our ships upgraded. All right. Come on. Hurry up. I want you to be done upgrading. I'm very impatient. Ships upgraded. All right. With that done, and now we have, what, two, three, six fleets. So we got two here, two here, and two here, which I think is good. Um, and we went through some psionic stuff. So, yeah, I think that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel for more of this. More Terrarium, more Starbound, more of whatever else I decide to do in the future. Follow me on Twitter for any updates as to what I'm going to be doing, what I'm going to be posting. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.